are you as sick of the prison bar debate as I am? I was as sick of it as soon as it started, let alone now. This is just becoming the biggest farce and wank and just cringy. <laughs> it's getting cringy. It's getting cringy because it's no <laughs> longer about... I feel like the, the supporters don't even care It's not anymore. about the Guernsey. It's not about the heritage. It's not about the supporters anymore. It's about the big fat cat egos that are flying around in the AFL. I know uh, one Port supporter... And I obviously know a lot of Pies supporters. Yep. None of them, none of the Pies fans are coming out going, if they wear the prison bar guernsey, I'm bloody writing a letter or well, we're protesting out the front of the AFL. The poor fan I know doesn't really, can't really be bothered too much about the prison bar guernsey. Like, obviously, they'd like it, but they're not stressed. Yep. Why? It's, it's like they're saying that this is war between the clubs, but it's just David Kosh and Eddie Maguire, who's not even <laughs> affiliated with the club anymore. Yeah. Just getting real personal and like <laughs> Eddie's on Eddie's on Fox Footy, so it's hard. He's on there commentating about it, but he's is is commentating on himself, like yeah. <laughs> and uh, and then he's decided to take it personal by bringing Koshy's bloody schnoz into the equation. He's Hoover. Well, Koshy was saying that Eddie McGuire's the Donald Trump of the NFL. <laughs> They're just going. This is it's turning very childish. Isn't what, it? what did you think about Port Adelaide putting the Guernsey on to sing the song after the game? I thought it was one of the most cringeworthy things I've ever you, seen. So you weren't a fan. I wasn't a fan just it, because it was, a, it was a bit smart alecky. Oh uh, well, uh, it wasn't even. I understand the smart aleck bit of look <coughs> AFL. You said that we can't wear it during the game, or you'll fine us four points. Fair enough. We're just going to wear it after the game and make a statement. But um, I just think that. If this was about something bigger than the Guernsey, I, I don't know. Like racism or... Yeah, or racism or... Yeah, any or if, say, say it was about um, they've gone, look, the the grand finals at the MTG every single year, and say they had a stat where 80% of the time the interstate teams lose because it's not, a, the, not on their back deck, and they were protesting it, I'd go, this is for something big, you know? This, yeah. is, this is for them to get a grand final at home. They're sick of playing, the, you know, something like that. I'd understand. Yep. But for the stripes on your Guernsey, who cares what Guernsey you wear? Does it really does it really matter? Yeah. Do you think it matters? So I was saying that I I think I've got the alternate view. In terms of everyone goes, they should be able to wear it, who cares? And I was listening to Eddie and he was saying Eddie it, VK. Yeah. Yep. And Eddie was saying it's like a trademark thing. Yep. Um and when you came into the AFL <laughs> Uh, they, you can't have black and white. And everyone's saying, oh, you, you don't own black and white. But when we think of oh, the, the blue and white team, you go, oh, Geelong. When you go, oh, the red and blue team, you go, oh, the Ds. Oh, the yellow and black, you go, the Tigers. So I don't think there's two teams in the comp that share colours. And I know you can't trademark uh, black and white, but if someone overseas was like, oh, who's that black and white team? Oh, Port Adelaide. Oh no, it's I don't know. You can start it to uh, dilate the trademarks of yeah. Both well, sides. well, for mine, I, when I say who cares, I'm not in the camp of who cares. Let them wear it. I'm in the who cares whether you're in your prison bar games. They just wear the bloody teal, mate. You're the, yeah, you're the teal side. That's Port Adelaide. Yeah, the Port Adelaide power. You're not the Port Adelaide magpies. Yeah, you're the Port Adelaide power. The Port Adelaide power of teal. Be proud of the teal, mate. Wear the teal with gusto. And as Eddie was saying, like. Look in the stands. Like the the supporters are wearing black and white. Yeah. Um. On their scarves, on their membership scarf, they've got the magpie as a bit of a nod. So they it, it is starting to get trademarky. Where I go, I do see the side of Collingwood, but I love the heritage and I yeah. I love the top and I love when they play in it. But I do see that uh, a murky water, which they're starting to step in. I love that fake mock up top where it's the prison bar Guernsey, but the white is teal, and it looks sick. Lovely. Why isn't it's that the It's the top? design, but it's the teal and black. It looks sick. It looks unbelievable. I reckon it almost looks, potent- well, not better, because the prison bar is a great top, but it looks unbelievable. So Why if don't they, could, they just run if, with that? If they, they could meet celebrate in the, mi- the old. If they could meet in the middle. Um, Apparently, there's rumours it's going to go to court. Like that, it, this will not Imagine be. Imagine rocking up to court over a footy jumper. <laughs> That'd be ridiculous. <laughs> You're walking in, and all well, the cameras on you. Sorry, uh, dub, sorry, double homicide. You just have to wait. <laughs> you just have to wait a second. We've got a prison bar, Guernsey. You, you'll be, you'll go, you'll go to prison in due course. Yeah. We've got a prison. You'll bar. get your day in court. Yeah. It's just not now. We've There's a footy jumper. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>